he had a gentle soul. He was quiet. He kept to himself. Um, he just had something in him once he started talking about the Native heritage and and the way he dressed with the with feathers and and the necklaces he made. And uh, one time he was wearing a buckskin vest. And you know, it, it made, I used to call him old man. <laughs> it's because of the way he dressed. He taught himself stuff, taught him how to do the spears, the, the, the arrowheads, jewelry, um, native drawings at times and just wanting to be with his mother because she was native. Like some of us are lost souls looking where we belong. And I believe that's what he was doing, was looking to see where he fit in as a native because he was stuck in both worlds. I got a phone call. Uh, I can't remember what time it was. It was in the evening by my sister Marie and said that uh, Gregory, Gregory passed away. I didn't talk to her much on the phone, I was kind of silent, but uh, when I hung up, I started crying because I'm never going to see him. But I know he's going to be here. I got memories.